Hello, hello, hello. Once again, welcome to Real Estate Investment Guide with your number one realtor, Victory Wealth. If you are visiting our channel for the first time, I know you will find value in this video. Please like and share this video with friends. Click on the subscribe button to subscribe to our channel and tap on the notification bell so that whenever I bring a new informed educative real estate video, you will be the first to receive it. So, right today, sincerely, I know everyone, including you, desires to own a home of their own, where they can probably say they are free from paying rent or they no longer have pressures from um, the landlord. You understand? You know how it can be when the landlord calls you a um, month to your rent, your rent has expired, and you know it's all pressure, pressure, pressure. So, a lot of people want to own their own home. So, and in today's topic, I'm going to be treating how you can own your own home, either an apartment or duplex. You know, here in Nigeria, especially in the city of Lagos, where I reside. So, now, one of the major challenges that um, a lot of people have is um, the challenge of having that bulk money to just go and purchase an already finished home, as in a home that has been totally built. So, and, and such homes involves um, tens of millions. And so the financial capacity of uh, a lot of people cannot, you know, um, enable them to do that. So, but really, it is important for everyone to own a home. So, how can you easily own a home without you paying so, so much, you know, almost cutting off your neck uh, or you breaking the bank? So, so, watch this video to the end. If you have not subscribed to our channel, please subscribe to our channel so you can always get well-informed and educative video. I'm always available to give you information that will guide you, make safe, secure, and profitable real estate investment. So, back to the topic. Why do a lot of people want to own a home? Now, um, there are several reasons you might want to own a home. Now, one of the reasons is you might want to own a home so that you can live in your home with your family, you know. And um, one of the beautiful things of owning a home, to live in a home, is you are totally free from the pressure of a landlord or the constant thought of how do I mop up a million, 1.5, 2 million, half a million to pay for my rent. Each time it gets close to that time. So a lot of people want to own their own home so that they can be free from that stress. You know, the thoughts can be really, really traumatic. Now, um, another reason people want to own a home is they want to own a home for cash flow purpose. What do I mean by cash flow purpose? A lot of people want to own a home so that they can maybe put it up for shortlet. You know, shortlet, a, a, a situation whereby somebody comes and hire a part of the um, um, a part of the apartment for say um, a day, two days, a week. Uh, someone is around for an holiday, so it's, it's a short day, just a short period of time. And trust me, a lot of people are cashing out big time. Cashing out big time is a very, very lucrative 
you know, form of making money in real estate here in Nigeria, especially here in Lagos, where I reside. So, shortlet, you just want to own either an apartment for shortlet purpose, so it keeps giving you cash, cash flow on a daily basis, on a weekly basis, and on a monthly basis. So, you are not really lacking money. Um, thirdly, why would people want to own a home? People want to own a home for rental income. Rental income. So you want to become a landlord of your own. So probably you will own a duplex and um, you're renting it out for 3 million, 2.5 million, um, depending on the location. You own a block of flats and um, you're renting it out. So on a yearly basis, um, you have rental income coming back to you. So it's also another reason why people will want to own a home. Now, disregardless of the reason you want to own a home, regardless of the reasons you want to own a home, I must tell you, it is really not easy to cough out, um, say, 40 million naira, 50 million naira, and buy an already fully built home or just have say 20 or 30 million naira kept aside and you want to build um, a home from scratch the foundation to the roof the internal finishing with a target of say three months really is quite not easy um, um, a lot of people don't have that financial strength. So today I'm going to be sharing a secret with you how you can own your own home with just a little deposit, say about 10% of the cost of the building and you spread your balance in a period of say 12 months 18 months, even to as much as 24 months, depending on the developer you are dealing with. So now, what are the process to you owning this home, using this form? Now, this form of owning a home, where you can pay, if you can commit an amount to the building, is called off-plan building project. Off-plan building project. So what do I mean by an off-plan building project? Now an off-plan building project is um, a situation whereby you the investor who wants to own a home, you commit a little percent to a building that is not in existent. So this building is either just in existent as a sketch on paper or as a 3D in the computer. So you have um, a 3D design of how the building is going to look like, be it, be it a duplex or an apartment, there's just a 3D design by the developer. So the, 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 the building, the property itself is not existing, but you are committing a certain amount to the commencement of that building. So the only thing that is existing is just the land or um, to a large extent, maybe just the foundation. So now, in another video, I'll be treating the advantages and benefits of investing in an off-plan project. So please don't, um, don't miss out on that video. I'll put a link to the video in the description of this video so that you can click on the link and watch, listen to the benefits and advantages of you. Um, um, tapping into an off-plan project. 
So back to today's topic. And once again, I say if you've not subscribed to this channel, please tap on the subscribe button, subscribe to our channel, turn on the notification bell so you can always get um, educative and informed real estate videos from us. So back to the topic. How can you buy your own home, be it an apartment or a duplex? In say 12 months, 18 months, or max 24 months. Now, there are processes to achieving this. Now, the number one thing you need to have in your mind is you need to have a budget in mind. How much do I want to spend for owning a home? And um, let's say I want to spend, say, 40 million there, but I don't have this 40 million there. But I know I can split and conveniently pay in the next 12 months or 18 months, depending on my income or depending on the business I do. I have an idea of um, the income I get. So I know what I can conveniently, you know, put down for this project and continually pay gradually. So your budget is highly, highly important. Most times um, um, when I talk to clients who say, I'm interested in investing, and I say, what is your budget? They say, ah, my budget is open. I say, no, 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 no. I need to have an idea of what you want to spend so that I can know because your budget we determine the location where you can get such a real estate investment. So number one, look at your budget. What can you conveniently put down for the first time installment? And um, how can you spread this in the next 12 months or 18 months conveniently um, without being pressured? Now, when that is done, the next factor you should be looking at is the location. Now, trust me, when it comes to real estate investment, location is key. And I tell people always, location, location, location. Now, the location you want to invest in is also tied to a budget. Now, you wouldn't want to own a home in the lucky phase one environment and feel you will spend the same amount when you want to own a when you want to own a home in um, in the Abraham Desoya environment. And then can you compare the price? When you want to own a home in the Brahmadisoya environment to when you want to own a home in, say, the Abijo environment. So, the location is very important. The location you are looking at is very important. Now, another reason why the location is important is you must be very, very sensitive. Um, your location, you should begin to look at what is your proximity to the major road, you know, so that when you're going out for work, you're going out for your business, there's easy accessibility. Now, what, what is the proximity of this location where you want to own your home to um, a facility such as the market? You know, easy accessibility to the market. Another thing with the location, what is the proximity to like an health center, um, a hospital facility, so that um, whenever there is need for it, there is easy accessibility to it. So the location is very, very important and the location is really tied to the budget. Is it that your location comes first and with the location um, one can tell you, your professional realtor can tell you what the budget is. 
or if you tell your professional uh, realtor the budget you have he or she can tell you the location you can get such a property so the location your budget now another process you should be looking at is you need to partner with a reputable real estate developer now a reputable real estate developer in the sense that this developer has in time past you know deliver such a project so it has to be a reputable real estate developer with past or previous record to have delivered such a project now uh, why is that so important now uh, for, for, for a developer who has done such a project in time past, there is every high tendency that the developer will deliver on this particular project. Now, another process you um, should be looking at is um, working with a professional realtor. A professional realtor. Now, Listen, disregardless of the fact that if you want to invest in an off-plan project to own your own home, <clears throat> whether you are in the diaspora abroad or you are here in Nigeria but so busy and you feel you have that family person, a brother, a sister, you can't compare them to a professional realtor because the professional realtor, the, 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 the real estate industry is constantly changing and the professional realtor is always, you know, up on his or her feet to ensure that he or she flows with the trend of things. And the professional realtor will always assist in some processes like your documentation, you know, visit to site to see that um, the work is in progress. You know, the professional realtor will always be there. And then um, that is one place I come in. As a professional realtor, I am available to assist you. To help you in every angle when it comes to you investing in an off-plan project to own your own home. Now, I'll, I'll be able to give you good locations for your budget. I'll be able to recommend a reliable, reputable um, real estate developer that you can work with who has a past record you know or previous record to have delivered such so that you your money does not you know you don't waste your money at the end of the day so i'm always available vic Cruel, your professional realtor i'm always available to to assist you and i'll be on ground to monitor the progress of things and to give you updates as things unfold now, what other process do you need? Um, you will need the process of verification. Of verification. Now, um, the land upon which the property is going to be built, and also um, there has to be documentation to show that um, there, there is an approved building plan for this project. So there has to be a proper process for verification. And as your realtor, um, we are also a part of a group of which before we recommend any developer to you or any off-plan project to you, we do our own due diligence to, be, to ensure that your funds are secured at the end of the day. But that doesn't mean you shouldn't do your own due diligence. In another video, I'm going to be um, 
taking the topic how to, you know, carry out due diligence on a property. That is not for today's video. So, um, and that is why you have to keep, you know, coming back to the channel. That is why you have to turn on your notification bell. That is why you have to subscribe so that these videos, as I keep dropping them, you keep give, getting um, well informed because trust me, you are investing a whole lot of money into this project. So your money, my top priority is to ensure that your funds are safe. You must have worked so hard to put up those money together. So my responsibility to ensure that they are safe, you know, and your responsibility is also to learn and you know, come to the channel listing, watch and then um, apply. So those are the processes um, you need to go through to own an apartment or a duplex here in Lagos for the next 12 months, 18 months. Now the sweet thing about the off-plan project as I mentioned before, you don't need to choke yourself so much. You don't need to begin to worry, how do I get 40 million naira? how do I get 50 million naira? to buy a full, you know, a full built um, building. You can work with the developer. Make a little commitment to this building that is not in existence, but you have a view, which, could, which is in a 3D form of how the building will look like. And the sweet part is, in the course of the building, you can work with the developer to, you know, you can work with the developer to fine tune things to your taste as the building is ongoing and everything you have that is coming with you is brand new. So, I'll be dropping links, some links in the description to this video, links to you know, reliable, reputable, you know, developers in different locations. You want a reputable developer in Lekki, I'll drop a link to that developer. You want a reputable developer in Aja, you want a reputable developer in Ibramadeshwaya, you want a reputable developer in Abidjo. Now, depending on where you want a reputable developer, we work with this developer, so we know them. We know those that have delivered on their promises in the past. So I'm going to be putting a link in the description to this video, to these developers, so that we can work hand in hand. Just reach out to me, call um, my number showing on the screen. I'm always available to guide you. And trust me, you will love it working with me because I'll always be available for you. So I know you've learned a lot from this video. Please, as I said, like and share this video with your friends. It can be a blessing to somebody. You know, subscribe to our channel by clicking the subscribe button and turn on your notification bell so that you can always receive this well-informed, educative real estate video. Thank you very much for watching and keep expecting me until I drop another bomb topic on real estate. Always available for watching. Thank you very, very much and God bless you. See you again. To my right, to my left, are other real estate topics. You can click on any one of them to watch. You never can tell which will fall into that real estate plan you had and you will thank me later thank you very much and catch you see you again bye